like that sucker right there. Yeah, it's um, and uh, that's perfect. Yeah, if you got a sliding gate, you're you're bison ready. It makes we'll life a whole lot easier. It'll be easier getting them out. Yeah.
Well, we had uh, part of a, what I say our Texas 16 uh, bison here <coughs> at the new ranch. And what we did was is we had to get rid of that bull, that pretty bull. He's about a four and a half year old bull. We sold him to a gentleman from Texas and uh, a cow and a yearling heifer. He's a, they're just starting to raise bison. Um, and uh, they got a place already set up for bison. So we sold him a cow and then this yearling heifer to help him get started. And he took a really pretty bull home. I, I contemplated on keeping the bull, but you guys know we've got Dunbar and Big Joe. So we didn't need him, um, but we sold him. And um, so now we've got four cows left and then we've got uh, four calves. So uh, the next thing that we'll do is we'll separate our calves and start the weaning process with them and then um, we're bringing somebody else over so yeah <laughs> so we've uh, had some fence repair done Kevin and a guy that is one of our neighbors built fences um, Richard uh, he came and he repaired some fence uh, put some nor some new corner post in and so we're actually gonna once Big Joe comes over here we'll be able to put them out into an actual 20 acre um, paddock or pasture so and uh, it's gonna be the first time they actually get out on a real oh. pasture. Here they've got some grass and whatnot in one of our um, one of our big corral areas, but we'll be able to actually put them out on grass now. Um, so now that we've got rid of that bull and when we sold those animals, we wanted to get rid of them first so that we could we could bring Big Joe over and that we could put them out in the pasture and we start bison ranching over here pretty much so put them out on grass which is a uh, which is where they belong so that brooks what about your girl eleanor huh what about eleanor <laughs> <laughs> 